Hey friends, it's Rosie from iHeartRecipes.com and in this video I'm going to show you how I make my easy slow cooked barbecue oxtails. So I'm going to start off with my oxtails. Now I know oxtails can be a little on the pricey side. So if you cannot afford oxtails, you can use beef neck bones for this recipe. I'm going to slice up some onions and off camera I did rinse my oxtails under cool water and as you can see I placed my oxtails into my large mixing bowl. My next step will be adding in my onions that I chopped up. These are yellow onions, you can use white if you choose and we're just going to place those into our bowl with the oxtails and then we're going to drizzle in some oil. I'm going to be using canola oil. You can use corn, any type of vegetable oil should do. And you want to make sure everything is nicely coated with the oil. So after everything is nicely coated, I'm going to sprinkle in my homemade barbecue rub slash seasoning. Um, I will leave a link down in the description box if you want the recipe for that. If you want to use store-bought barbecue seasoning, that is completely fine. But again, I will leave a link down below in the description box if you want to um, use my recipe for the barbecue seasoning and it's also on my blog so if you're watching this video on my blog you can find it there so in this big pot I'm going to add in the onions and our oxtails I place the pot over medium-high heat and now I'm just going to start searing the meat now don't forget if you want the exact measurements for this recipe please be sure to visit my blog iheartrecipes.com I will also leave a link for the full recipe for this oxtail recipe down below in my description box and after I seared the meat, again we just want to brown the outer parts, we are going to place our oxtails in our slow cooker. So we're not going to turn the slow cooker on just yet, let's just place those in there. And again, this recipe can be found on my blog iHeartRecipes.com. So we're going to head back over to our stove top, the heat is still on, and I'm going to start pouring in some chicken broth or watered so you can use one or the other I think broth has more flavor but water works as well and now we're just going to start adding in our barbecue sauce you can use a homemade barbecue sauce or a bottle of your favorite barbecue sauce and we're also going to add in liquid smoke now I'm a little heavy on my liquid smoke you don't have to add as much as I'm adding but I'm going to add a little over a tablespoon so once all that's in there I'm going to mix it until it's well and combined and now I'm going to head over to my slow cooker and I'm going to pour in that barbecue sauce mixture don't forget I am on Instagram so if you are on there as well come follow me chat with me let me know what you want to see me make next again I'm at iHeartRecipes on Instagram and once everything's in there, I'm going to grab the lid to my slow cooker and I'm going to set it on low and let this cook for six hours. So after that six hours, the oxtails are going to be super tender. They should be falling off the bone because they have plenty of time to cook. So I just served mine with some brown rice and a salad, but if you want to make this a really nice soul food style meal, you can serve the oxtails with some mac and cheese and collard greens and cornbread and baby, you are good to go. I'm just going to sprinkle some parsley flakes on top and that is it. I want to thank you so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. Subscribe if you haven't already and visit me every Sunday and Wednesdays for new video uploads.